Let's solve 2x minus 5 is equal to 3 minus 4x. Here, we want to solve 4x. We need to get like terms on the same side of the equation. I'm going to attempt to collect the terms with x variables on the left. So I'm going to go ahead and add 4x to each side of the equation. So I'm going to have plus 4x plus 4x. 2x plus 4x, those are like terms, so I end up with 6x minus 5 is equal to 3. The negative 4x plus 4x term is 0, because negative 4 plus 4 is 0. So 0x zero is what I have left here. Now I'm going to collect my constants on the other side of the equation. So I'm going to add 5 to both sides. So plus 5 plus 5 to balance the equation. So now I have 6x, negative 5 plus 5 is 0, 3 plus 5 is 8. And now the last step to get x by itself is to divide by 6. So I have 6 times x, so I need to go ahead and divide by 6, and I get x is equal to 8 over 6. This fraction is not in lowest terms. I'll have to divide by 2 to get x is equal to 4 thirds. As a quick reminder before we move on, we can always check our work. We can substitute 4 thirds into the original equation into each x and make sure that the left side equals the right side. I've gone ahead and worked this out to show that this is true. When we substitute 4 thirds into each side and we go ahead and simplify, which does involve subtracting some fractions, we end up with the statement negative 7 thirds is equal to negative 7 thirds. So we end up with a true statement, therefore verifying 4 thirds is the solution. In this example, we're going to solve 2 times the quantity 1 minus 3t is equal to negative 21 plus 5 times the quantity 2t plus 3. Before we gather like terms on each side of the equation, we are going to need to distribute. So the 2 distributes over subtraction, and the 5 distributes over addition. So first, we're going to do 2 times 1 is 2, and 2 times 3t is 6t. So we have 2 minus 6t is equal to negative 21 plus, well, the 5 distributes to 2t, that's 10t and 5 times 3 is 15, so we have plus 15. On the right side, we already have like terms, so we'll go ahead and add them together. Negative 21 plus 15 is negative 6. So 2 minus 6t is equal to negative 6 plus 10t. Now we are at the step where we're going to collect like terms on each side of the equation. This time, I'm going to move the terms with the variable to the right side of the equation, just because I'd rather have positive uh, coefficients in front of the variable. So I'm going to go ahead and add 6t to both sides of the equation to balance it out. I'm going to have 2 on the left, because negative 6 plus 6 is 0t, is equal to negative 6 plus 16t. Now I'm going to collect the constants on the left side, so I'm going to add 6 to both sides. 2 plus 6 is 8, negative 6 plus 6 is 0, so the right side is just 16t. And now to get the t isolated, I'm going to divide by 16 on both sides. So 16 divided by 16 is 1. And now I have t is equal to 8 sixteenths, which can be reduced in lowest terms to 1 half. 